So, hello. My name is Jason William Egroff, and I created Revelation News in about August of 2011. I had a website uh, called revelationnews.net that uh, I did some articles on, a few articles. about. It was about Israel at the time and how they were massacring Gazans. That's amazing, isn't it? Uh. I did a couple articles on that website. And uh, my mom was alive at the time and she was like, what the hell are you doing? Because I showed her it. I was like excited. I was like, this is what I want to do with my life, really. Is be like a alternative news reporter about end time stuff. And she's like, you take that shit down. You don't want to be like Alex Jones, do you? Being harassed and shit. So then I prophesied over my mother and I, because I, I got kind of angry and I said, you know, my, he might take you out of the way if I'm supposed to be doing this. And she got offended, but she passed away soon after that. And then uh, I started Revelation News. Well, actually, the, the name of my channel on YouTube before it was Revelation News was called the Tento Saga because I was actually going to do like some... I was going to try to do some graphic stuff for characters in the book and, and like maybe do an audio book thing with it so to have a YouTube channel for the book, you know. But I changed the name of the channel from that to Revelation News. And then I started, my first video was called American Jokers. And I made it with Windows Movie Maker. And I took picture portraits, the presidential portraits. And I had their regular presidential portrait. And then I altered the image to make them look in the face like the Joker. The crazy Joker paint with red over their eyes and like frown red lips. I did that in editing, and then I said, it's all the same. Like, it's the American Jokers. They're all, the presidents are like all the fucking Joker. They're just laughing at you, you know? That was my first video. Then my second video was about trying to get 9-11 Truth out. I was at, if you, I don't even know, but this might be possible, but if you go back in the days on CNN when Rick Sanchez was putting people's tweets up on the TV... I was a regular all the time. He put my stuff up and said my name like a bunch of times on CNN. But I was the Tento Saga at that time because I was promoting my book through Twitter. I, I had one. I was on Twitter real early. Like, yeah, very early I, in the existence of Twitter. Uh, but I had Tweet Deck and everything. I was using that for like promotional stuff for just vanity projects. You know what I mean? And I was a liberal at that time, actually. And I was I, I, I entered myself into the Obama t-shirt contest. You remember that? I designed t-shirts for that. Um, but anyway, why am I making this video? The reason I'm making this video is what is, what is the purpose of Revelation News? Because anybody that would make their name that, well, I created that name. So there's a purpose of what you're supposed to be doing if you're using that name. So let me inform you. And I've always said this about the moniker Revelation News, okay? Because I would come on my prophecy channel when I had it. And I would go, JWE Revelation News here, okay? Revelation News is like a journal, a journalistic moniker, if you want to call it that. OK, I never had I was never credentialed in terms of being a part of the media. I never had media cred credentials, so I wouldn't call myself a member of the media, but see it like a journalistic media title. But under the auspices of the Bible and Jesus and prophecy, that's what Revelation News is. And I always said this about it. If you want to call yourself Revelation News, you can you are Revelation News too. Anybody could you could say it? Uh, hey, this is Shannon Eileen McGraw, Revelation News. Absolutely, you do that. Uh, I this is Gary Lamont Moore, 
Revelation News. Yes, you can do that. But you better do the right thing in what you're saying on the channel. If you're going to call yourself that, you have an obligation now. And that's to point people to Christ through the headlines and what's going on. That's real easy right now. You point to Gaza and it's the second holocaust. It's real easy right now to be Revelation News. But if you use that name, if you put that as your channel name, you better be talking about Jesus and prophecy. The Lord Christ blessed all. The entire creation is going to bless it with the spirit of Elijah. Hallelujah.